attacking the rim, creating some separation. That's a good shot for him there. They give it to the superstar Laput. He gives it back to McClure. Down, down low and bank off the window. And now it's just 10 and 4 here at James Moore Fieldhouse. Falcons coming in on a one game winning streak and hit a big one. Conference, what a gem the Owls found. He just needs eight points coming into this game for 1,200 in his career as the Falcons. Five steals. Just absolutely unbelievable in a six time any 10 honoree. Falcons trail by two. That's going to put him back up over 100 points in his young career. And the sky's the limit for the 5'11 freshman out of Queens. And he can't points in his young career. The 5'11 freshman guard out of Queens has been stellar coming off the bench. A lot to look forward to for him with an Owls uniform. It's a very rhythmic team, this Owls team. And, and once one guy gets hot, then everything falls into place. Deep three by Bentley, and it's on the... Bagshaw, the wing wide open. That's just one I think you got to pass out. And that's Bagshaw shot as he's battling with some tight defense, but a nice turnaround jumper. Interesting, they got Diara on Laput. Now it's McGettigan trying to get some length there. McGettigan with some tight defense, and the final shot at the buzzer, and it's a big three ball by Bohannik. And that was a good... Games that are close if they cannot hit their free throws. Bentley leads by one, takes it strong uh, to the hole uh, was Evan Missick, the sixth bound for Bentley. 15 seconds left on the shot clock. They go down low. Stewart and those three fouls trying to not pick up another one. So four rebounds in the game in just 11 minutes. McClure, a little turnaround. Gets that one to fall. And good math major at all, but I'm going to say that's a point a minute for Cazell Stewart. 12 points, three boards in 12 minutes. And a big three ball by Zach Laput. The helmet Bentley, Jay Lawson is 33rd season. Under his guidance, the Falcons have achieved winning records in 29 of 31 seasons, making Lawson the winningest and longest tenured coach in the program history. And they get another big one right earlier in the game. When he was getting those looks, he was throwing it off the glass as a shot here is put away. And that's Bohenic with Bentley trying to get back into it here. 18 seconds left on the shot clock. Now finding themselves in a six point hole. They're trying to get three the easy way. And Laput takes it inside for the hoop and the harm. 924 left here in the game. The Owls with their largest lead of nine. 14 seconds left on the shot clock, and a nice dime down low, and 14 seconds left on the shot clock. Stewart gets the ball stripped away. Latham dies for it. Two on two fast break. And it could be a travel on Laput. They are going to call the hoop and the harm. Took a couple steps there. Ball for the Owls as McGettigan's checking in now. We'll see who he takes out as Laput takes his one to the rim. Back out. The three ball is Latham. Rain. Latham. Charges may applied on that long distance call by Marty Silvera as the lead grows a 2 5 for the Owls, but right back at you, says Zach Laput. <laughs> Fans that made the trip from Massachusetts are on the other side, but this side's filling up right here. Also, the Latham, Missick, and Bohenic all have three personals for. Six to nothing run for the Falcons. Bagshaw checks in the game, taking out James as Laput puts it away. What a shot. What a cool. 113 left to play. 15 seconds left on the shot clock. The superstar, Zach Laput with the rock. Williams on him tight. Laput looked like he traveled, no call. And he gets the kind roll and gives Bentley the lead with 60 seconds remaining. Court, they give it to the, exactly who you said, Zach Laput. Six seconds left on the shot clock. Goes up against McGettigan and gets it home and gives Bentley the four-point lead. That, that's tough. I mean, I don't think the Owls did a bad job defensively today. They held the best-scoring team in the conference to under what they averaged, but, you know, I think there's just some things to work on on both sides of the ball for the Owls. And that's a final. The Bentley Falcons, a 72. Southern Connecticut State University, 66. Make sure you...